Hi, I'm Dr. Sunil Ishwar, Consultant Laparoscopic Surgeon and Infertility Specialist at uh, Apollo Cradle, uh, Jayanagar and at uh, Motherhood, uh, Banchankri and also a Clinical Director at uh, IKEA Speciality Clinic and Fertility Center, Kanakpura Road. Most of the women, almost 40 to 50 percent of the couple who desires to pregnancy undergo a diagnostic histolaparoscopy. It is not a routine investigation to be done in all women to find out the cause for infertility. It's as recommended by the World Health Organization, there it doesn't fall into a routine investigations. But there are certain indications when the laparoscopy may be indicated. Generally, we, in, we suggest a woman to undergo diagnostic laparoscopy when there is any other coexisting pathology which can interfere with the normal conception. Like if the patient we on scan find that there is some endometriosis or there is hydrosalpings or we suspect that there is some adhesions distorting the pelvic anatomy. Also in women who has polycystic ovaries as in polycystic ovary, we would also plan to do a ovarian drilling along with a diagnostic lab. Or any woman who has uh, hydrosalpings, we may have to think about doing hydrosalping clipping. And also in women where we have not established tubal patency, test, uh, tubal patency with less invasive uh, testing like uh, histosalpingography or sonohistogram, in them we can do a laparoscopy as it's a gold standard to do a tubal patency with a laparoscopy. Generally, along with laparoscopy, we also do histoscopy. We have found that almost 25% of women, when we do a hysteroscopy, we find that there is certain amount of intrauterine problems which may interfere with the normal conception of the women, like polyps or intrauterine adhesions. So when we are doing a laparoscopy, we combine it uh, together with hysteroscopy, which is known as hysterolaparoscopy. But as I said, you have to discuss with your infertility specialist about the options and the pros and cons of doing a hysterolaparoscopy as this turns out to be invasive testing. But hysterolaparoscopy happens to be a daycare surgery, can be done in any good fertility setup with a good uh, surgical hands.